But if you see these on your car, then you might have something to worry about. Let's begin. Of course, it seems like in the days we live in now, criminals tend to be more brazen with their actions or crimes and basically appear not to care about any possible consequences. Admittedly, you know, I could be wrong. However, markings like this tell a different story if this story is anything to go by. It just makes me wonder what they're thinking. Well, if those eco-protesters can get away with it, then so can I. So be warned. The article says that speaking to the Liverpool Echo, Laura Morgan first thought the Markins, which were two sets of different sized crosses, were simply children or teenagers messing about when she first discovered them back in October. However, the Liverpool driver started to grow concerned when she noticed that they were only being drawn on in the ice, which developed as temperatures dropped overnight, and she shared the images with others who said the marks are a sign or a code used among thieves and burglars to communicate with each other and indicate who to target. The Merseyside mother has since urged other drivers to check their car windows in the morning for any bizarre markings. Of course, I don't know if it's just me, but I wouldn't think it's very clever of a criminal to share their findings with other criminals, especially if they attempt to break in. Because if they do, then surely the other criminals will just break into it before they get a chance. If they need to come back, that is. So to be honest, that does seem a little bit strange. Although hopefully, as more and more doorbell cameras are about nowadays, it will hopefully be much harder for criminals to break into things and places without getting spotted or identified, and then get their knuckles wrapped as a result. However, prison sentences in general don't really seem to be much of a deterrent nowadays because, let's face it, how often do they actually go to prison? Not nearly as often as they used to, I'm guessing, especially as there are a lot of overcrowding in prisons nowadays. And not forgetting, of course, the lenient sentences which some judges do tend to give people, especially if you're an eco-protester, that is. Although, according to the so-called Da Pinci Code, an X or cross means that the home is a good target, while a circle with an X means that it's not worth robbing. In a chilling turn though, people have also warned that a triangle symbol could signal to other criminals that a single woman lives in a property on her own. Other letters like M supposedly tells other burglars to strike in the morning, while N means a nighttime intrusion is best. However, police have previously warned residents not to overreact to any painting symbols outside their homes. Well, personally, if I come across any markings, then I'd probably be very tempted to turn it into a giant set of gonads, or maybe write them a nice little message with something with the word off written underneath, which reminds me of this video with one of the government's latest brainwaves, or DNA harvesting, as I like to call it. Anyway, subscribe for more, and I'll see you in the next one.